What are you guys doing? Where's Laura? How's the refit going? Answer to these questions and more coming up. As for what we're doing right now, um, some friends had an emergency and asked us to help them out. Helping them out involved, well, dogs, cats, horses. Laura just couldn't resist. Here's a look. Uh, part of our duties house sitting here at this place is to keep the dogs exercised. These are two well-trained bird dogs. Uh, taking advantage of <laughs> inexperienced handlers. Laura knows what she's doing, but boy, you should see these guys when I try to work them. <laughs> <laughs> Powder. <laughs> Any excuse to jump in the water. Yeah. Come on, you guys. Go play in the water. Yep. <laughs>
Yeah. There's dot running off over there. The refit's coming along, slowly, but it's coming along. Uh, we're making progress every day, and eventually we'll get it done. The boat is seaworthy, and we plan, as soon as Laura gets back, we plan to take it down to Wrangell or Port uh, Protection or someplace like that, uh, just to do a little cruising for a change. Today I'm going to put the first coat of varnish on these pieces. These are the floors for the midships lockers. Well, I know conditions aren't ideal, but we need to make the progress on these things, so we do the best we can with what we have. Sometimes that means you have to do the work on the boat or on the dock. It's not the first time we've had to go this way. I'm sure it won't be the last.
since these are the floors for the lockers there, I'm not terribly concerned about a beautiful finish, but we do want it to look nice, as nice as possible. And it's going to look pretty good. <laughs> have to work through these conditions here, otherwise we're never going to get it done. Never. And I think uh, one of our next projects is going to be redoing the cockpit lockers. I'm going to make new lids for them. I've already reconditioned these, what, twice? We've refinished them uh, once and rebuilt them and refinished them a couple of times. But it's time. And this time I'm, got, I'm not going to do it with teak because teak is too hard to get and too expensive. So I've got plenty of sapele and so that's what I'm going to use, sapele. Okay, I think that's it. I think that's it. And as for where's Laura, um, somewhere between Petersburg and Wrangell, I think, or maybe down at uh, Prince of Wales Island down at Kaufman Cove or Thorn Bay. She left yesterday uh, in the Halley along with uh, Dr. Ken Hill and uh, another assistant to make the rounds in the uh, islands south of Petersburg. Bye, Laura. See you next week.